Today, we're diving into the world of gaming controllers, exploring the features that make each one unique. Whether you're a console enthusiast or a PC gamer, the right controller can enhance your gaming experience. Don't forget to subscribe and check the video description for links to the featured products. Number one, the Xbox Elite Wireless Series 2 controller is the top choice, boasting unmatched customization, including D-pads, paddles, and joystick tension adjustments, with improvements like a portable charging case, a 40-hour rechargeable battery, and Bluetooth compatibility for mobile gaming, it's a versatile option. Despite its higher price tag, it's a must-have for serious gamers seeking performance and customization. Number 2. The Scuf Instinct Pro competes with top-tier controllers from Sony and Microsoft. It offers extensive customization options, closely resembling an Xbox Series XS controller. The thumbsticks are responsive, and the triggers provide a pleasing experience. The ability to use AA batteries is convenient for mid-tournament changes. While it's a bit expensive, the Scuf Instinct Pro is a strong choice for premium controller enthusiasts. Number 3. The Razer's Wolverine Ultimate is a standout gamepad with features similar to the Xbox One Elite wireless controller, including a swappable D-pad and customizable back paddles. It's priced similarly, but it lacks wireless PC connectivity, making it less versatile. However, it offers unique features like tactile button clicks on the face buttons, providing a significant improvement in gaming experience. The controller also features Razer's signature Chroma RGB lighting, but it requires a separate app for Xbox One, which may be a consideration if you plan to use it on your PC. Number 4. The PlayStation 5 DualSense controller offers an immersive experience with haptic feedback and adaptive triggers, but it requires game support. While not as comfortable as the Xbox Series X controller, it's a great choice if you prefer Sony's layout or gyro aiming. Using it on a PC is straightforward through Steam, although it relies on the older Direct Input API. Updating the DualSense firmware on a PC is now simplified with an official tool from PlayStation. Despite some complexities, it's a well-built and responsive controller, especially if you like Sony's design. Let me know in the comments which controller is your pick. If you found this video helpful, give a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel for more product reviews and recommendations. Thanks so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one.